Hello everyone, welcome. We are playing a little bit of Little Hope. I probably shouldn't use the word little in that opening, but oh well. <laughs> Greg and I are back to play some more scary games, even though October is officially behind us now. Um, little Hope has been all the rage. It and, just came uh, out. Greg is going to have the controller for this one because I'm a little jumpy boy. I got to I got to steer the I steer the the bus. The bus this time. Don't don't look at that. That doesn't exist. Uh, I was just for a tech test. We're but we're going to override that. Override and it never happens. It never happens. This is the first time we are ever seeing this menu. You could not go back in time right now with the video and check to see if that's true or not. Yeah. And here we are. The winds of change. I mean hope. Little hope. <laughs> Roadside diner. This is where the game turns into a bus driving simulator. It just a little thing pops up, and it's <laughs> it's like follow the icon on the map to go pick up your first guest. <laughs> I'm like, oh no, I hate driving sims. Could it be like? Someone should do that a horror game driving sim. <laughs> like it's it's this atmosphere, but you have to like go to each thing. And you don't know what's gonna happen along the way. Oh, no, I don't wanna. <laughs> it's foggy all the time. No. Horrible driving conditions. It's really pretty though. It is pretty. This is nice. A nice spooky music. Some good apps uh, apps. We did mention in the open, but if you're not familiar, people that made Little Hope are the same people that made Until Dawn and the previous Man of Medan. This is uh the second of their trilogy. Yes. Hello, Ossifer. Hey. Thanks for pulling over. You're welcome. Sure. Something wrong? We got a problem up ahead. A big accident. We've had to close the road. You're right. We're diverting all traffic through Little Hope. You okay, buddy? You seem a little confused. Didn't you notice the music drop there when you said the name of that town? Yeah, I'm fine. I just want to get these folks to where they need to be. I doubt a short delay will trouble them too much. Head up the East Road. Takes you straight through Little Hope. Adds almost no time to your journey. I grew up there. I know. Has anyone thought of maybe giving the town a less ominous name? <laughs> Oh, well, time to drive over this rickety bridge. Sure, it's fine. <laughs> oh, yeah. oh. You rub that chip any harder, it'll wear away to nothing. This guy's seen How some long shit. Been yeah. He's shy of three months. Impressive. I heard the first 90 days are the toughest and roughest. I know it doesn't add up, but I get something from holding on to this. We're going the wrong way. It's fine, just a quick detour. It's not fine. Calm down. It's all okay. Oh, Don't please, distract John, me. could you I'm not driving. patronize me? Can you keep it down, please? <laughs> See, I got distracted. Look away for a few seconds. My bus. <laughs> the true villain of this game. I'm not going to check that bearing. We'll, we'll look at it later. Also, fun little side thing you notice on the side of the bus where it says ferryman. <laughs> <laughs> the 
the true villains were the passengers. That's what we learned from that snippet. <laughs> the real friends were the passengers we made along the way. <laughs> oh, ye is snow. Snow house. Snow house. <laughs> In the middle of your snow. Oh. Stop it, James. You know I hate it when you don't take the things I say seriously. Come on, sweetheart, I do. I just had a rough day today. Can you believe they are at each other again? I can. You're drunk. What a surprise. I just caught the game with the guys, honey. That's it. That's not it. Never is. There's talk. Some of us may be losing our jobs. The factory. You've been saying that for years. I'm more worried about Megan. What's wrong with Megan? She looks okay to me. Everything looks okay after 10 beers. Reverend Carlson I mean, held her back after yeah. press today. That's four weeks running. She's not right. It's serious, James. You worry too much about that kid. I can't deal with this right now. Another surprise. You can't deal with anything. When would be the right time? You're making a mountain out of a molehill. Getting yourself worked up for nothing. For Why nothing? Don't you go park the car around the corner, James. <laughs> our family together family. Is far from nothing in my book. I could use a little help. Maybe if we'd had kids of our own, none of this would be happening. That's a real low blow. Don't you get how tough You're not the only me? one feels pressure. The factory situation is serious, Anne. Real serious. What kind of factory? Not right now. Okay. The not right now kind. <laughs> <laughs> I guess I can't ask about the factory. Not tonight. No <laughs> not looking at that. <laughs> tonight I don't have a daughter. <laughs> There's a snick. Don't tread on me. Ten snick. is late. She always is these days. Uh, uh, yeah. Tanya has always been late. Nah, not really. Tanya. Only since she's been seeing him. That guy's no good for her. All that new age bullshit. Reminds me of some creepy cult. You're you're a cult. <clears throat> He came in last week. We shot the breeze a little bit. I like him. Yeah, that I'm the easy going classic. guy. Legendary vinyl. Quit pawing at it, will you? I know it's just because he has like heavy eyebrows, but he looks like such a jerk. <laughs> like... <laughs> no, my cartoons. My tunes. Hey, Bigfoot, no. find the goddamn vinyl, will you? Hey. Uh, don't, don't be a dick. Come on, man. Take some time off from being a dick and give her a break. Okay, Mother Superior. Yeah. Why are you always sticking up for her anyway? Yeah, what is the dick factory closing down? <laughs> <laughs> it's because I am a good big brother or cousin or something or whatever, I guess. Friend. Or a adoptive I don't know. brother? I don't know. They said kids of our own, so I'm guessing. Yeah. Is, this a, is this a foster house? Hello. I'm going to start climbing through the window unless that door gets fixed. Thanks, whoever you are. That's Husbands. the guy they were shooting the breeze with. Yeah. Let me guess. He's been pumping iron again. They've been at each other's throats since Dad got home. What's it about this time? Um. The Dad's been it's drinking. About saying nothing. Yeah. <laughs> Who could have guessed it? They're always fighting these days. Getting predictable. Like a record that keeps playing over and over. And Dennis, over for the over. 10 millionth time, will you shift that shit of yours up into the attic? Hey, some respect. This is a valuable, rare, and sought after collection. Yeah, <laughs> big old records. <laughs> Things will never get smaller than this. I think she was a Marine sergeant of past life. Haha, <laughs> <laughs> past life joke. It's crawled up his ass. Uh, he's, he's being him. Dennis doing what he's good at. Being really Dennis. What a surprise. Working overtime at the dick factory. <laughs> <laughs> nah, Alright. Time for you to go up that ladder and nothing hey, to Dennis. go wrong. Hey! Not now, sis. I'm busy. Oh, that ladder's gonna fall. <gasps> hey! Quit acting crazy! Hmm. I don't like that. Hi, Mom. Oh! Ah. 
That was unnecessary. Jesus. Yeah, that, that was a little... You scared little, me, sweetheart. unnecessary. I heard you talking about me. Not now, Megan. I'd like to have a bath in peace. Take a break from this madhouse for a while. Wow. All right, now I am going to be nice to her. Everyone's everyone's trying to ignore her. Look, I know whatever the setup is that I adopted the four of you, but fuck off. I have big key now. I am the power. You idiot. Maybe you should talk to mom and dad. It's not a great idea for me to get involved. Why? You know what I'm like? I just upset someone. What do you sounded mean? sounded more serious than the usual bullshit. They were talking about Megan. She's done something bad. I can't say I'm surprised. There's definitely something off with Megan. I don't get why everyone keeps picking on her. Okay, Mr. Shining Knight in Armor. Where's yeah, how the dare you have I any have? fucking manners? Screw you, dude. I... 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 Uh, leave Probably her better alone, than leave Megan alone. As her big sister, it is my sworn legal duty to check in you, on you her. You know what? That's fair. You right, should do that. sure. Like, you're the law around here. Why is everyone acting upstairs. like that? I'll go find her. <laughs> I don't care what you say. I'm going to be terse with you. <laughs> I'm just trying to, like, just just be easy here. I'm like, yeah, sure. You go check on her. All right. I'm picking up things. No, you pick up the matches. Looks like a match. All right. Yep, those are some All matches. All right. I guess I'll take that and light the stove. And, and cook this on. kettle. Yep. Am I going to make tea? I don't know. Maybe. There's actually nothing in the kettle. Was this? In time with the... Oh, god damn it. Okay. But button may change the triangle. No! What do you mean? I pressed it! <laughs> You need to keep an eye on your little sister. He just turns around, stabs you. Oh, Mom's first character lost. Bro. Also, I made it way further. Uh, yeah, for sure. We're, it's okay, Dad. I got it. Tanya's checking on her right now. You want to try raising a family like this? Not really. The devil himself would struggle with you guys. Uh, okay. <laughs> I should know. Me and him were talking at the pub earlier. <laughs> Alright, well, what if I turn this TV off in front of you? Can I do that? Nope, I guess not. You just put your foot through it. <laughs> Haven't you get bent, Dad? Let's see, what else is going on in here? I think you hit the button a little early. <sighs> That's gonna mess me up. I mean, it's still better than like the Until Dawn one where it was like, the don't, don't move. move the controller. Yeah, that was always the worst one. Wait, 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 wait. Eh. Shiny. Yes, I'm gonna leave this home. Fuck you guys. Bye guys. Oh, it's locked, I guess. I can't leave my own home. It's the dining room. Don't worry, guys. No strangers are coming into this house. Hello, all. Nothing shiny in here. Son of a bitch oh, clock. No. What a bitch clock. <laughs> <laughs> all right. Can I check this? Is it? Is it? All right. It's nothing. How dare you try to interact with things? I'm just trying to... <laughs> That's shiny. I'm looking at that. It's a... Uh, it's a poople. Poople nam. Alright, Megan. Attendance. Oh, it's a report card. Wow. Megan is in even more trouble than That's I That's a thought. lot of Fs. That's a lot of not good. A and an E. <laughs> <laughs> what does that mean? Uh, it means that they did an excellent job, I'm sure. Go back to the other side. What was the uh, number of days present, days absent? Days tardy, 18. Well, what does the E even mean? Like, because, like, there's no there's no reading of that. And there's... Is it just the one? There, yeah, I just see one. All right. Maybe she drew on it. Maybe. Or maybe the teacher's just fucking with the family. <laughs> They're like, you know what? They don't even look at this report card. I'm going to put an E on here. <laughs> What fucking idiots? Is this the front again? No, this is another. Yeah, this is the back door. Yeah, let's leave. We're out of here. Wow. It's locked. It's locked. I can't even leave my own it's house. It's still locked. <laughs> <laughs> All right, well. 
What's here? It's locked. <laughs> this book is locked. Witchcraft. What's this? Little hope. Seven ninety nine. In this economy? Let's pocket that. No, let's take it with us. We'll, we could use that. Witches. Anthony, where the hell are you? But interactable. Anthony, where are you? God damn it! Shut up, Tanya. There's an interactable. <laughs> Anthony, I'm getting really pissed off. I'm getting pissed off. Why? I'm interactable. <laughs> What? <gasps> Spoopy music identifies. What you write about my family? I think so too. Oh, Tanya, what's going on? That little brat Got locked me fingers. out. It's fucking freezing. <laughs> oh no! I'll let you back in. Go easy on Megan. Hold on. All right, so not for nothing, but you could totally just break the window and open the door. Shit. What is the floor made Megan. out of? You in there? Or more specifically, like, what is that pot made out of? <laughs> the whole thing went up in flames around the pot. The kitchen's on fire. Are you fucking serious? Megan. I knew we should have covered the floor in alcohol. This wouldn't have happened if I could have just gotten to those two last examinable things. You know, that last shiny thing was a fire extinguisher that we really should have grabbed. Oh. Ah, uh, fallen ladder. Mom! No. Where the hell is everybody? Anthony! Help! <laughs> well, rip. down from the hole in the attic like like he maybe would have like hurt his ankle yeah. a little bit but dad no dad also terrible, but, you know, there's only so much I could have done for that. Wait, why are you... Alright. Alright, you're fine because you're outside, so I'm gonna... Tanya, hold on! I gotta get Megan out! Yeah. Upstairs. Oh. Okay. Megan. All right. I suppose there's nothing to save there. Why are you going back inside? Literally, everyone's like, you know what? Is the dumbest series of actions we could decide to do. Why? <laughs> Man, you know... That's just unfortunate. That's just tough. Yikes. Hey there, neighbor. I see that you've got a fire going on. Hey, about those tools I let you guys borrow. Uh, are those in there, or...? What have you done? 
What have you done? What do you mean, what have I done? You walk up to a, a house on fire. You see someone fall and die. And you look at the one survivor and you're like, what have you done? <laughs> like, uh, it's, it's fine. It's like in horror situations, people always do the dumbest thing for whatever reason. Yeah, you know. There was no possible way for me to save anybody, I'm sure. I'm really upset I couldn't see those last two things, though. Won't you spare me over till another year? I would say intro-wise, that one was a little less exciting to me than the, uh, the Man of the Dam one with the uh, soldiers. This is fine. I... I have mixed feelings. I I kind of like this one a little better because I think it's a little more uh, until dawn esque. All right, yeah. Where like it, it throws you right into it, and it's like, hey, by the way, people are gonna fucking die. Yeah, true. Your choices matter. Yeah, I yeah, sure. Where the first one, because it was all like soldiers, you're like, eh. Or I guess I should say you spend the whole time wondering like, how do these soldiers relate to these characters on the play as? Yeah, that's fair. I want this to play when I drive to work. <laughs> I just feel good walking into this estate every time because of the, the music is vibing for me. Super massive games. Yeah. Alright. Dramatic pause. Follow this compass. Look to the left ominously. Wait for the beat. Nice. <laughs> Perfect ending. Is that a person Hello. out the window? And welcome. I don't believe that we've met before, have we? Uh, no matter. Welcome to my repository. I now there's nobody at the window. am a curator, the guardian of all these wonderful stories. And I have a very special tale for you to tell. Thank you. That's polite. As long as it's really special. I want a room like this in my house. Just a big old library? Yeah. <laughs> Disconcerting, no? I'm sure there's nothing to worry about. This particular story isn't fully fleshed out. It's only part written, and the choices you make will complete it. Oh, yay! I get to be a writer. I feel like he's just being lazy. <laughs> no, there was nothing you could have done about that. Oh, okay. What's happened has happened. Or has it? Anyway, You don't just get to end future, your sentences with question marks to make yourself sound Life's smart. Life's a walking shadow, eh? <laughs> you couldn't have stopped the fire, or could you have? No! Enter. If only you would have gotten that last interactable. Perhaps disturbing world. How disturbing might depend on what you choose to believe, and how confusing on the path you choose to take. There are an infinite number of directions in which one could travel. Yeah. We seldom have all the information that we'd like, but we have to choose our path nonetheless, and hope that we get the clarity and the outcomes that we want. As in life, your decisions will matter. I get it. The choices you make will affect others. You've seen how the story starts. So much depth. And that's how, how it'll more end. Depth <laughs> we'll make sure of that. Up to you. Yeah, it depends on the decisions that you make. What are you? Rational? Emotional? Do you trust your head or your heart? There is no right answer. Sometimes one is best and sometimes the other. My advice for what it's worth is... Lead with the pee-pee. To thine own self, 
be true. If I believe in the heart of the cards... Who are you looking at? But, uh, <laughs> I'm here simply to record what you do, not to help you. Wow. <laughs> I'm not supposed to interfere, you see. Not my place, apparently. But I am apparently allowed to share wise words from great storytellers that have gone before, where I feel that that would be appropriate. Oh, one final thing before I let you go. There are pictures in Little Hope that will, if found, show you a vision of a possible future, something that may or may not happen. Use no them. <laughs> they might help you. Or they might not. You have a funeral to attend. Off you go. Have fun. Thanks. Hmm. Remember all those people you just let die? Enjoy. <laughs> Funeral, nice. Lit. Some probably fresh hors d'oeuvres at the service. I feel like because this is a trilogy and he's kind of the central thing in all of it, from that we're supposed to infer that there's like a fourth story going on mm. kind of thing that's like the narrative of him between all the games. Well, he was None of us here today can understand why this tragic accident happened. Yeah, I'll let this play first. But we can take comfort from the knowledge that the family are together for eternity. Tanya Clark. embrace. No, it was the the guy. There was a boyfriend. And now we're all sad. Uh, anyway, isn't the narrator also the one from Until Dawn? No. No? Is that uh, similar, like, function and, like, setup, but uh, different actor, different, like, facial. Okay. Hello. Andrew. Am I, am I pronouncing that right? <laughs> Anxious detached. <clears throat> hey, what's good? The ghost is hunting. <laughs> Taylor. The latte girl. John. Rational and overbearing. That's a good Where combo. Where the hell's Daniel? I can't find him. I don't know. Damn it, Daniel. Instead of goofing around, you want to lend a hand here? Sure. How is, How he, is he doing, doing anyway? It doesn't look that serious. Could be concussed. John okay, likes Professor. me now. Or should I call you doctor now? Why don't you try calling for help? <coughs> Maybe the cops, someone like that. All right, well, uh... Yeah, I'm on I it. I already tried once, but... I'm on it. Yeah, I'm considerate now, I guess. That being said, he was kind of like... Hey, Andrew, the last buddy, doing? <laughs> What about the thing that I literally was we? doing when you yelled at me? <laughs> what happened? Yeah, the bus crashed. We're okay, though. Just shaking up. If you say so. I don't remember being in any crash. You're, you're probably in shock. Maybe a mild concussion in there, too. Give yourself some time. Stay here. Don't move. Where are other people? Is it just us three? Oh, bus drivers. He got yeeted. Fucking thing, useless piece of crap. May as well be dead. Okay, take it easy. We'll figure out what to do. Oh, hello. Ah. Ah. Damn, Daniel. Fuck. Where's my phone? I'm sure it's fine. You got a flashlight <sighs> that fell conveniently. <sighs> Mature student. I really felt the need to put mature student. Hey, anyone up there? 
just could have been like student. Hey, Daniel, yeah. that you? John, good to hear you. Daniel? Danny. All right, so we got Taylor, five you people. Okay? I'm good. We're fine too. Thanks for asking. He, you okay I, down there? I'm all right. Nothing I can't deal with. Hey, John, any idea what caused the crash? Not sure. Looked like the driver swerved to avoid something in the road. He down there, by the way? Nope. No sign of him. Weird. He isn't up here either. Can you get back up to us? Looks pretty steep. I see a trail down here I could try. Great. Take the trail. Should take you to the road. We can regroup there. That's a plan. See you soon. <coughs> okay. Oh. Hey, Taylor. Help me get Andrew up on his feet, will ya? No. I'm gonna step Wait. on his feet. I, mean, I don't remember anything. Who are you? It's okay. You're concussed. I'm John, you're a college professor. <coughs> we were taking a bus on a field trip, but that didn't work out so well. Crash wasn't on the curriculum. <laughs> uh, we'll find the others. Teacher joke. Get some help. Think of it as a character building exercise. Let's press the matching prompt. Yeah. QTE is my favorite. 100% success rate if you. Teamwork at its finest. Forget the whole uh, the fire. <laughs> so real. Flames all around us. It was grim. That bang on the head must have been a beauty. That trail the others are on will come out down the road. We'll meet them there. Uh, 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 neither of those sound right. Yes, I guess say nothing. Why can't we stay here? No, we could be here all night. Our best move is to get to the others, then head towards town. See if we can find some help. Uh, uh the bus driver, though. Where's the driver? Shouldn't he be back by now? The driver's done what we should be doing. Gone into town for help. Oh, okay, sure. I guess. You're right. Let's go. I'm with you. I'm right? The quicker we get help, the quicker we can all go home. Stick close behind me. <laughs> this this <laughs> seems like an appropriate time to gloat about that. <laughs> we just got in an accident. The bus driver is missing. We're, we're... I have very little information. Yeah, like, I don't understand driver. why I should fight. Just taking off like that and ditching us? Maybe Let's run. Ruins. Could just be in shock. Oh, Where that's a shiny. His responsibility, his passengers. He can't just stroll off. What's that? Is, is a can? Oh, you're oh. kidding me. Now what? Looks like something out of a creepy horror movie. Is a Actually, stick. you're nearly right. I've seen stuff like this in books. It's there to ward off evil spirits. Cool. Jesus. This really is a night full of nightmares. Hope it wards you off, Professor. <laughs> <laughs> Welcome to Abandon Hope. Ha! I like how it says in the subtitles, unreadable, yeah. even though it's just like, hmm. There's a single line through that. No one can make that out. You'd have to be some sort of wizard. You know this place? Little Hope? Or some no. sort of witch. I mean, I don't think so. You should both know Little Hope. Uh, why? Why should I? Why should I have heard of this place? Seriously, this place is steeped in history. Fascinating stuff. All right. H how do you know all this stuff anyway? <laughs> I'm what a professional you, sort of academic. Professor? I read books, unlike some. <laughs> Easy, <laughs> Einstein. I can match everything you got with just a smartphone. Well, your phone isn't so smart without a signal. Is is this the time for like clapbacks, truthfully? <laughs> All right, what else is over here? I say we let John die. <laughs> yeah, let, let's just we'll ease into that. Oh, fence. Hello. Good to see you two, finally. Everything okay? Sure. We took the scenic route. You sure as hell took your own sweet time. He's getting worried. I bet you were. Thanks. This gate is chained. We can't get through. Look around. See if there's anything we can use to break it. Think this'll do it? It was shiny, so I knew it was interactable. <laughs> I'll push hard from my side. Ready. Three, two, one. Push. Yeah, button mashing. Let's go. <laughs> yeah, that's what I'm talking about. Great job, Mass you that <laughs> And that's it. Now we're all saved. 
game over. We are all together. <laughs> What's the plan now? Head into town, see if we can get help. You know where town is? Sure, we're near Little Hope. It's in a Sounds direction, like a I'm sure. Place? Funnily enough, Little Hope does have an interesting and dark history. Funnily enough, because I know you all were asking about it. Bad things happened here a long time ago. I'm really happy. Which you are dying to tell us all about. To know I'm that there's starting not to like on. you or your attitude. What do you I'm mean? I'm not even started yet. You want a little more? Try to be civil. Cost nothing. That's rich, given how you badmouth Taylor on the way over. What did she say about me? You always get your boyfriend to stick up for you? Try doing it yourself sometime, dear. Uh. <laughs> <laughs> uh. <laughs> yeah. You're running out of time? <laughs> We're picking that one. <laughs> I'm not wasting another breath on you. Quit it, will you? The last thing we need is you causing trouble. Keep out of our business, okay? We are wasting valuable time here. Can we please just keep moving? You think this is a like, solid plan? Could you not be assholes for two As seconds? Like, the first thing you're going to do is just be like, yo, your attitude sucks. Before, are you serious? I'm not so sure now. <laughs> so what do you want to do? Hey, some of us are bruised and bleeding. How about you come with me? Well, why don't you get your bus? boyfriend to stand up for you? <laughs> okay. I still think the smart move is for us all to stick together. You'll be glad we didn't stick together after we flagged down a car and come rescue your ass. No, wait, he's actually right, though. We probably should stick together. All right. Bye. <laughs> Time to leave. You get lost? Uh, no. We're back here? This doesn't add up. This is some very weird shit going on here. Spare us all. First he loses his pride, then he loses his way. Yo. What are you trying to say? <laughs> that you've lost it. It's not possible. What a clap back. Look, I don't know what you're trying to prove here, but we've got better things to do. Daniel? Whoa. Hey, careful. Watch out. Quit fucking around and tell me what's going on here. What do you mean? The two of us will she, go together. She just was with this him. This is getting ridiculous. <laughs> Indulge me. Whew. I like how they held hands and then they stopped immediately. Yeah, like they immediately stop here. as soon as they go into the fog. What? I walked away from you. We're trapped here. There's no way out. I, I don't understand. She's right. We walked dead straight going away from you. So how'd we end up back here? Huh? What, what's your science okay, got to say about something. that? We'll all go together. We came from that direction. We must be able to go back that way. I want everyone to stay real close. No stragglers. All right, I'm going to go behind them. And you want to put us on a, a kid's bit. line? Okay, okay, I'm coming. No stragglers. I'm going to stay behind and straggle. Hello, it's me, Stragglepuss. <laughs> Perfect. And now we're by the fence again. Nice. I admit that is a little odd. Yeah, that's right. It is. More than a little. Stupid. See? What did I tell you? It's just like I've been saying. We are trapped. We can't leave here. Now okay. what can we do? Calm down. Breathe. I have seen one upsetting There's thing. There's a rational explanation for what's happening. Maybe we all died in the crash. Yeah, nice theory, but I'm pretty sure we're all still alive and kicking. For now. Last I checked, you were schooling us on creative writing, not metaphysics. I know who I'd like to be kicking. This is all down to you, this pissy little field trip. Now we're stuck here in little no hope. That is way out of line. I had no way of knowing that damn bus would crash. You can't put that on me. I know tensions are, are high. Real? Watch your tone, will you? I am doing my best to understand this, just like you and the rest of us. Uh, you're right. I'm sorry. I don't get what's happening to us. I don't understand. It's like you said, we're trapped in a nightmare. It's okay. We're gonna be just fine. Dressed like a daydream. <laughs> Figure a way out of this together. Someone else thinks they can do a better job? Step right up. Uh, maybe it isn't real. 
We have to get out of here right now. I need to think straight. Why the fuck? Can everyone just shut up? Thanks, Andrew. This isn't helping us find help or getting us out of here. He's right. Bitching at each other isn't getting us anywhere. We have to work together as a team. Thank you. Says the person who started. No, that's <laughs> Let's not talk about me just the going off a second ago. Between us but to be fair, that's the usually bus. the case. There is no fog between us and town, so let's head that way. I don't get how heading further away from the bus helps. There is nothing on the bus we can use to get help. In town, there will be people, a working phone, something. It pains me to admit, but he's right. There's nowhere else we Why can go except into that damn town. you to admit that? Sounds like a plan to me. You I hate me? to agree with the man. <laughs> Come on, let's go with them. Until we know what's up, we should stick together. Man, I... Oof. All right, we finally have control of our character. Here's, here's a good place to stop. All right. Thanks all for watching. We'll, uh... We'll catch you next time. Yeah, we'll be back with some more little hope. Why did Have you a good say day, everyone. Be dead. Bye. You really think that's possible? I stopped talking, Taylor, so we can leave. Brain keeps going for a while. <laughs> <laughs> I stopped them. There we go. All right. Bye, everyone.